Okay, we're visiting here today with Shaw quarterback Matt Keller, and we're talking about the Eagles' upcoming 2015 season. Sean, let's start first of all with, uh, if you would share with us some perspective on uh, what the expectations are for you and your teammates uh, for the upcoming season. Well, you know, this season uh, we have a couple of additions to the Catholic League, so uh, the schedule is a little bit different. So I think first off, what uh, you know, the main goal is, is to get through the non-district schedule first. Uh, I think we've got some new teams like Terrellings on our schedule. So if we can get through those, uh, get a little bit of confidence going in the district, uh, you know, we play teams like Rumble, Curtis, uh, which is a new addition, um, St. All, Holy Cross, they're all good teams. So if we can get the non-district schedule started off right, I think going into the district will be all right. What do you think will be key for you guys in order to be successful? What do you all have to do as a football team? Well, as a football team, you know, it all starts with the running game, the offensive line. If they can block well, give the ball to Trey, uh, open up some holes, which will open up the play action game. Uh, anytime you can run the ball, you can throw the ball, in my perspective. So, uh, running the ball will be big for us. And what do you think will be strengths of this year's Shaw football team? Um, well, we have a lot of experience in the secondary, uh, uh, the skill position on offense. We got some new receivers, but uh, they're coming along well. Uh, Trey, our running back. So, I think if we run the ball, we can get thrown the ball, and then in the secondary, we were experienced. We got some good athletes back there. And um, kind of give me—you uh, don't have to handicap it, but kind of give me an assessment of uh, uh, what you think the Catholic League race is going to be like. Well, you know, uh, every year uh, the Catholic League they're strong. You know, they got some good athletes in there. Good teams. They're all well coached, uh, well disciplined, and then um, I mean they all play hard. So it's always a tough district. It's always tough to play in. Um, it's even tough to go 500 in that league because, I mean, you always got to be ready game in and game out. Uh, you know, it's never a walk in the park against any team. Uh, so I think that league is going to be strong. One more question about y'all offensively. Uh, um, it, it would seem, you know, you have some uh, uh, good skill players returning. That includes uh, Trey and yourself. So I would think offensively you guys should, you know, uh, not not have problems scoring and such. What's your thoughts? Well, uh, you know, everything starts with the offensive line and how well they do. Um, they're getting a lot stronger this year. They're getting a lot better. Um, but really it starts with the offensive line, like I said before, running the ball. Um, the young receivers, you know, knowing where they're at, knowing what to do at all times. And, uh, you know, it really starts with the offensive line for it. Okay. And finally, for, with, for a player perspective, uh, What's your thoughts uh, about the addition of John Curtis to the league? You know, it's certainly a tradition-rich program with all the national, not national, excuse me, with all the state championships. Well, you know, John Curtis, I mean, they're a powerhouse. Uh, you know, they got some good athletes. They're well coached. Uh, in addition like that, well, I think it will make us better. You know, I think it will make us play harder. Uh, and um, all together, I mean, it's just going to be fun in the Catholic League. It's going to be fun to compete against good teams, uh, good quality opponents. And I mean, they're well coached, and uh, I think you know if we if we play our best, you know, we'll give them a shot. Is there any kind of uh, uh, motivation there to maybe kind of uh, uh, not kind of to uh, uh, welcome them into the Catholic League, and uh, uh, so to speak? Well, you know, that I mean, they're always the big dog in the state. You know, that's always the most talked about team, and uh, you know, I think putting them uh, in the Catholic League, it'll give everybody a shot to kind of compete against them, and. Uh, give them a run for their money because, you know, everybody knows Curtis, you know, not even in the state, but around the country. So I think, um, you know, if you got a big one against them, it really uh, gets you some recognition as well.